Hello everyone, Sergeant Thomas here, and this video is going to be a tour of this little house that I've been building here lately. I have finally finished it, and it's ready for a little tour, so that's what I'm doing. Also, there will be a link in the description where you can download this world and, you know, do whatever you want with it. You know, add on to the house, build a house next to it, role play in it, blow it up. It's your choice. I hate the rain. I'm going to find a bed and sleep. I guess I gotta make one. I'm gonna make my bed and sleep in it. Okay, I can't place a bed. What's going on? I don't have arms. Where's my arms? Come on, you can do this. Come on, there you, there you go. Son of a... It, it figures it would rain right when I start recording. I've been having a lot of bad luck lately. Who am I kidding? I've had bad luck forever. Um, anyways, I forgot what I was saying, so... Anyways, back to this. <laughs> um, I think I was saying there will be a link in the description for this house where you can download the world and you can do whatever you want to the house, whatever. And also, I have a question for you guys, and if you know the answer to the question, let me know in the comments below. Uh, I've had a few people ask me if one of, you know, one of my previous worlds that has been up for download, they would ask me, is this world, you know available on the PlayStation 3 and my answer to them is I don't know uh, basically what I think they're asking me is is since this house in particular is built on the Xbox 360 say they go and download this world can they then download it to their PlayStation and play this Xbox 360 save on their PlayStation 3 if you get what I'm asking because uh, I don't know the answer to that I don't know if those work together I don't know but if you know the answer to, answer to that, uh, please let me know. I'm sure I could just search it easily, but I'm lazy. And as you guys can see in the video, I don't have arms. So I can't type on a keyboard. I'm just kidding. That was horrible. Um, but let's get to the house tour and ready, go. Um, as you guys can see right here, we have a dock to begin with. It has three parking spots. And apparently two of the three people that came over to visit me don't know how to park in parking spots or they left their motors running in reverse and their boats backed out of their parking spots. I don't know what happened. Um, but anyways, we got a dock with three parking spots and a pathway that leads to the front of the house, right up to the front doors. And so yeah, here's the front of the house. As you guys can see, it's pretty much made mostly, if not only, of wood and cobblestone. And I'm using the city texture pack if you didn't know and were wondering. So that's the front of the house. And here is a pond. It's a little simple pond. It wasn't, you know, too crazy. And then here's the left side of the house. There's no windows right here. And this thing, because that is a fireplace, which you will see inside in a moment. Here is, like, the back door. And this back door has a gravel pathway that leads back here to this village. And there's also another village over there if you download this world and want to, like, play survival in it. There's two villages right behind the house, basically. Um, and what was I going to say? Oh, yeah. Also, I didn't do it on purpose, but as you can see, both the village and this house are made out of the exact same materials. And I literally, honestly, seriously didn't mean to do that. I just, it just happened that way. I didn't even know the village was there until I was done. I'm kidding. I actually did know it was there, but I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> It almost looks like I did, but I didn't. Here's the back of the house. And again, where this pig is at, you can see there's no windows here. But that's part of the way I furnished the interior. It turned out the way it did to where I couldn't put windows there or I didn't choose to. And yeah, so that's the back. And then here is the right. No, this would be the left side of the house. If you're looking at the front, this is the left. Left side of the house. And as you can see, it's kind of somewhat built into this hill. Just a little bit this corner anyways and there's always a pig under there or not a pig a cow um so yeah that's pretty much the exterior the roof's pretty plain you got the fireplace the little access part to the roof from the inside and some tables and chairs uh i could have obviously done more to this house just like i say in it to a say about a lot of my houses is yes I can add more it's minecraft you, can, you know the possibilities are endless but there's some other things I've been working on so I'm glad this house is finished and I'm doing this tour now so I can go focus on those things and 
get those things done since Minecraft, Xbox One Edition, and PS4 Edition are soon going to be in our hands because they are both insert testing. The PS4 Edition is insert testing for the second time. And let's hope that this is the first, well it is the first, but let's hope this is the only time that the Xbox One Edition hits cert testing and it goes through smoothly and we get the game. Uh, but kind of got off topic there. But yeah, we enter the house. There's a chandelier up there. And then we got a hallway here. But I'm going to take a step back and go left here. And we're in the kitchen now. And here's a table and stuff over here. And the stove. And there's something I want to say about this. And I'll kind of explain it more at the end of this video. But if you guys want to see how I make my refrigerators work. Because see when I press this button, it shoots food out. So it's an actually functioning for refrigerator. Uh, but if you guys want to see how this works, I've never... Well, I, I've made a tutorial on this before, but since they've updated the game, they messed with the redstone, and I had to reconfigure how I did this, and I figured out how it, you know, works now. Uh, but if you guys want a tutorial on this, uh, just let me know in the comments below, and I'll make a tutorial on how to make this fridge, and you guys can put it in your house. It's pretty simple. But it, it's obviously too hard to explain, and just looking at it, if you're not really good with redstone, and even if you are, you might not be able to look at this and be like, oh, I see how that works. Just because of, you know, the angles I might be giving you or whatever. And I'm... How, what is this? I don't even know what... What is this floor made out of? I don't remember. Let me see, can I fix it? Oh, it definitely wasn't that. Is it this? Yeah, there we go. Um... But yeah, just let me know in the comments below if you want a tutorial on how to build this fridge. And I will do so. Uh, and I'll explain why I there isn't a video of me building this while I was building this house. At the end of this video, I'll explain why. It's very annoying. Um, but anyways, we come into this room, and it's kind of like a great room slash living room. Yeah, that's what it is, a living room. It's a living room slash great room. You got the TV... The fireplace I showed you from the outside. And then the back door that leads back to the village. So yeah, that's that. And then as you can see, it's high ceiling in here. And it's got like a balcony kind of overhanging. It's like a, I don't know, a quarter of this room or not even. But anyways, we'll come down here. And right here, this is a storage room. And this just happened to work out while I was building the staircase. Staircase. I cannot talk right now, and I apologize. I'm trying to talk fast. I'm trying to do the. the ah! Um, this room just happened to turn out like it did because of you know obviously the staircase that I built while building the house. So I turned it into a storage room. So we got a washer, a dryer, you know, a chest, sink, all that stuff. So it's just a storage room under the staircase. So if we come this way, I got heads, yes, I, I am a crazy person, I have heads in my house. Here is a guest bathroom, that's just one entrance into it. And then down here, this, oh, play some blocks. I need to empty my inventory, there we go. This is just, you know, one of the guest bedrooms. This house is a three bedroom, three bathroom house. Um, and then this is the other entrance into the same bathroom you just saw from that door. So yeah, it's pretty simple. Do, do I have a leak up here? I just you see water drip. Oh, yeah, we got a leak. We must call a plumber immediately. <laughs> but yeah, here's that room. Now we'll go up to the second. That's basically the, the whole first floor. So now we'll go up the stairs. And check out the second floor of the house. Got some views. Over here, we got a view. So yeah, that's coming up the stairs that's that's the view you get right here coming up so this is the little balcony that overhangs the great room slash living room I don't even know if there's a difference between a great room and a living room I have no idea I feel like there is for some reason here's the chandelier from the front door that leads up to the roof we'll check that out last uh, we come over here this is another guest bathroom And again, another entrance from this guest bedroom to a guest bathroom. Computer, bookshelf, table, you know, just normal stuff. 
This is the smallest house in the room. Like I said, it's only a three bedroom, three bathroom house. And then the final bedroom is the master bedroom. And as you can see, the layout, like the shape of it, is pretty much the same as the room below me. Well, that sounded wrong. Uh, the room below me. <laughs> uh, it's the same like layout, except the only difference is that there's no separate entrance because this is the master bedroom and bathroom. So there's you know only one entrance, and that's from the master bedroom part into the master bathroom. Bathtub, toilet, the normal stuff in a bathroom, TV, couch. I feel like I'm kind of like rushing this tour a little, and I'm already 10 minutes in, and I didn't want to make this video 10 minutes long, but my videos always end up longer than I want them to, but that's just, that's just how it, that's just how I roll, I guess, I don't know. Um, but that's pretty much the house, you know, this, the last thing here is just a staircase that leads to the top of the roof. And so yeah, that's pretty much the house. Again, this isn't my best house. It isn't my worst house. Uh, I do think it's a nice house. I'm proud of it. I'm happy with it. I like it. Uh, let me know if you guys like it. I normally don't ask for likes. I hate doing that. But if you guys like the house, could you please leave a like? You don't have to. It's totally up to you. Uh, but if you do, you know, leave a like. I would appreciate it. Um, but anyways, that's the house. Like I said, there will be a link in the description where you can download this world and check it out for yourselves. And also, again, like I said at the beginning of this video, let me know if Xbox World saves work on PS3 or vice versa because people ask me that and I don't really know how to answer that. And I'm curious because maybe I can download some PS3 worlds on the 360 or whatever. Um, so that's pretty much the, the end of me touring this house. But I do want to rant, possibly cry a little here. So if you don't want to really hear that, you know, you can obviously leave. But the reason I do want to rant, quote unquote rant, or basic, basically explain something really quick is because if you have been subscribed to me and you have been watching me build this house, there is a video missing, and that was me, f you know, the video of me furnishing the second floor. You know, I recorded the whole structure of the house, you know, the outside, all the floors, the roof, and then me furnishing the first floor. All that went fine. But the last video I tried recording of this house, I was recording, I was furnishing the house, everything I thought was fine. I quit recording, saved it. I saved and exited the game. And then when I went to try and uh, edit the video, you know, something happened. The video wouldn't work. It was like corrupted file and all this crap. And at that point, it was too far. I, you know, like I said, I had already saved and exited the game. And I couldn't, you know, restart by recording again and refurnishing the house because it was already furnished so I decided you know whatever I'll just give this tour which you know is this video now and let people download it and all that plus I'm not too mad about that because really furnishing is probably really really boring to watch to begin with but especially when it's me because I suck at commentating um, so I'm not too mad about that but that has to do with what I was talking about with the fridge in here is when I was furnishing the rest of the second floor I came back down here and if you guys did watch those other videos you'll remember there was a hole in the floor like this where none of this redstone was here and so what I had did is I came down here took a break from the second floor furnishing and was like let me go work on this fridge try and get it to work got it to work and the video got corrupted so nobody got to see that except for obviously me who built it so that's again why I ask you guys if you want to see a tutorial on how to build this fridge just let me know in the comments below and I will try to make a tutorial on that uh, it's not that hard so I should be able to do it but I'm not gonna make no promises because I don't want to promise something and not be able to deliver it and then make myself look even you know stupider if that and then stupider is not even really a word <laughs> shows how smart i am no but uh also the video you're watching right now i already tried recording this and something had happened where i recorded this again thought it was you know fine and dandy everything was good went to edit edit the video and there was like a minute and a half of the video gone so when my audio was of me talking like i'm now 
the video would end, but I kept talking and it was just blank for like a minute and a half. So I don't know where two minutes of my video went. It just disappeared. And that really made me mad because I already have a tough time syncing my video and audio together when they're both, you know, it's all there anyways. And then when I got some of the video missing and some of the audio not, it's just like, and that really ticked me off. So I had to re-record this even, and hopefully this doesn't mess up. Uh, but anyways, I know I'm just like kind of ranting and complaining and crying and whining and wah, 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 but I always like to explain myself on things. I don't know why, because half the time people probably don't care. But for those that do care and that have made it to this point in the video, I appreciate it. appreciate everybody that views my videos, subscribes, likes, comments, all that stuff. I really, truly appreciate it. And really quick, hopefully this will be really quick. I already mentioned this before, and you guys have probably already seen the video. I have been working on a new house. It is a modern mansion. All I have really left to do is furnish it the rest of the way. The first and second floor is a three-story house. The first and second floor are pretty much furnished. Got to finish the third floor. A little bit of exterior stuff. And then I will be able to, to give you guys a tour of that, as well as a download link to that you know world with that house built in it and everything. I'm trying to talk really fast, and my jaw's starting to hurt. Um... But yeah, that's pretty much it. I've been working on this house. Finally, it's done. You guys can download it now. I'm working on that other house. And hopefully, in less than a week from right now, which is August 31st, we will have Minecraft Xbox One in our hands. Not literally in our hands, but you guys know what I mean. And we will be able to start building, creating, doing all kinds of things, having fun. And that will be awesome. So... I wanted to get this done, get that next house done, and start fresh on the Xbox One, and start hopefully doing some epic builds. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm ending it now. My jaw's about to fall off. And I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you, thank you, thank you for watching, and have a good one.